Thank you, Chair. Dear Commissioner, Madame la Ministre Klinker, we have spent the past two years talking about how we emerge, how to emerge from the COVID-19 crisis stronger. We have spent two months of war in Ukraine doing the same. A crisis has this green gift of providing ample supplies of one of the most elusive and valuable resources Europe needs, the political will to embrace change and to do the things that need to be done. I applaud the continuation of the sanctions, but we are still far away from the parliament position. We still need ambitious tools and the instruments to move forward. In the pandemic, we have created the RRF and other funds and measures that showed solidarity that kept our businesses, sometimes barely afloat, and helped our citizens. Now, in two months, we have moved defense supplies of an unprecedented scale and opened our countries to many more millions of Ukrainian refugees that we had seen during the 2015 refugee crisis. We do have right now a momentum of political will to reinforce our capacity to act for all Europeans, Ukrainians included, as they firmly belong in Europe by culture, values, geography, and now by bravery and commitment. I think it is time, indeed, to use the RRF at its full potential, to use all the resources, to use all the lessons learned and the solutions for the member states, and this is part of the response. But at the same time, we should focus indeed, and I was really pleased to hear today that there is a discussion about the recovery plan from Ukraine. And for that, we need indeed to use the lessons learned from the RRF that are indeed valuable. The world will never be the same again, and a Russia with Putin in charge will never again be a partner for Europe. So there is no more status quo to return to, and we need to create a new normal, one with reinforced financial tools that will ensure no European is left behind in the aftermath of Putin's war, and Ukraine and Moldova as well get welcome their needs from the EU and that we emerge once again stronger together. Thank you.